I, I grew up in a, um, a very loving and supportive um, faith-driven household. And I never really felt like my faith was, was lacking. Um, but as I got older, the, um, the Sunday sermons just didn't grab on to me. I, I didn't feel like I, I understood them as, as I, I should have. I felt like attending church was, was a box to be checked. Um, but then just didn't really know how to get closer to God. I think really it, it became apparent for us both, my husband and I, as we had children. And we wanted to, you know, raise a family together, um, w you know, within God's presence. And we didn't know what to do or where to go or how to go about it. So we took a break from church for a while and then came to Northridge on a suggestion from some friends. We fell in love with it. I mean, it wasn't necessarily instant. We walked in and thought, there's no windows and there's no pews and this is really different than what we had always known. We all left, all four of us, my husband and my two children left, deeply moved and impacted by that. And, you know, we all kind of looked at each other and said, well, what do you think? Do you, would you do it again? And we all said, absolutely. I wish I could say that there was a moment that stood out um, to me. I feel like there were many moments where, where I realized that I, I did not have control over, um, you know, whether it was a, a, a positive time or a, a stressful time or uh, a time of, of great despair or great joy. Um, but realizing that God was always reaching out to me. He was always there for me, and He was always walking with me and guiding me through that process of saying, I'm here for you, and I, I want you to follow me, and I want you to be, be on this journey with me, not just to, you know, put one foot in and one foot out. My life has changed pretty dramatically since placing my faith in Jesus. Um, I'm... I'm much more carefree. I don't have fears as, as I did before. Um, it's not to say that I don't have worries and doubts or don't get stressed out about things or, or um, that I'm anxious, but I know that through the things that I've experienced with, with God and God with me, that I wasn't meant to have the answers. I wasn't meant to be the one at the helm. I wasn't meant to be the one in control, that God's in control, that God had a plan for me. It, it's a plan that I now fully understand. It's a plan that I, I want to be living every day with, with purpose and conviction. So I am choosing to be baptized, for sure, wholeheartedly. <laughs> well, Kate, today we celebrate with you as you publicly declare through baptism Christ's death and resurrection, and we celebrate that by grace through faith, God has made you alive together with Christ. So because of your profession of faith, I baptize you now in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Yeah. <laughs>